Hi, this is Emma, and welcome to Esoteric Detective. Scientists have successfully switched on the world's largest stellar rate fusion reactor. Dubbed Wendelstein, or by the simple W7X, the reactor is designed to contain super-hot plasma for more than 30 minutes at a time. This week, the reactor produced a special super-hot gas for a tenth of a second. Scientists hope that, if it can work for longer, it could eventually lead to limitless supplies of clean and cheap energy. Yesterday, the reactor produced a helium plasma which reached a temperature of 1 million C. We're very satisfied, concludes Dr. Hans Stefan Bosch, whose division is responsible for the operation of the W7X, at the end of the first day of experimentation. Everything went according to plan. Containing super-hot plasma for long periods has been the holy grail for reactor designs, and could help scientists provide an inexhaustible source of power. The stellar rater design was first thought up in 1951 by Lyman Spitzer working at Princeton University. But at the time, it was thought to be too complex for the constraints of materials available in the middle of the 20th century. Now using supercomputers and new materials, Researchers have finally made Spitzer's vision a reality. The machine took 1.1 million hours to assemble, using what has been described as one of the world's most complex engineering models. The test revealed that the magnetic cage for the fusion plasma, which has a temperature of many million degrees, was working as scientists predicted. If the machine works for longer periods of time, scientists believe it could herald a change in the direction for fusion power. What do you guys think? Is abundant energy on the horizon? Stay tuned and subscribe to Esoteric Detective, to keep up to date with the strange and unusual. And please give a thumbs up if you liked the video, until next time. Goodbye for now.